When keeping a population of fish together, it's pretty much guaranteed that at some point you're going to deal with a fish that's injured, whether it's through fighting with another fish, injuring itself on the interior design of the aquarium, or just through handling. First things first, don't worry about it, it happens in nature. Here you can see an African cichlid cruising through the water. It's obviously been injured and a secondary bacterial infection has occurred, and that's what would account for the cotton wool-like fungus on it. Right, so things to remember is that to prevent it getting worse, provide pristine water conditions. That's number one. Secondly, we want to prevent it getting any further. Here's a Lulupia tanganyikan fish. It's got a scuff on its forehead. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to treat the tank with Melifix. Melifix uses natural ingredients to prevent bacterial infections getting in further. Now, it won't stop it in its tracks. Once the infection's there, you need to treat it with something like furin, which is a, a broad-based antibiotic. But what Melifix does is prevents the, the wound getting any worse. So basically, you're putting an antibacterial plaster on the fish. It's really good for once you've handled fish, whether it's stripping them, moving them, that type of thing. We also use it on any tanks when we've added new fish. It aids fin regeneration. It gives a good slime coating. Even when fish have been breeding, they've been a little bit hard on each other. So by using something like this, you're really saving yourself the possibility of it getting worse and becoming infected. And I think prevention is better than cure. So once again, we're making sure that we've got good, clean water. We're treating the tank with something like Melifix, which is going to prevent the infection. If you have to treat it, then we can look at something like furin um, to treat the bacterial infection itself. Hope this has made sense to you. Creating natural looking aquariums that are easy to maintain.